along well, but I wanted you to, to sort of move around a bit more, do more dancing. It just was a bit static. And then the belly button fluff thing, you know that's where I drew the line the last time. Naughty put, boy. I didn't put it in my mouth this time, Amanda. I did well, it for I you, suppose. sweetheart. Oh, that's never an excuse. That's <laughs> never an excuse. Thanks, Amanda. Simon, you also buzzed. Why? Well, because a drag out the whole purpose is you're supposed to look like the person you're impersonating. But I'm a comedy drag out, Simon. I don't need... Uh, Right, Beyonce? Okay. No, that's no. the whole point. You just look like a fat bloke in a red wig. <laughs> but he didn't, but apart from anything else, he didn't go anywhere. It was, you just stood there, nothing changed. And look, let me just remind you, the whole purpose of this show is, is to find somebody we assume the royal family would like to see. I don't think they want to see you. I think they want a bit of a laugh. Piers, Piers, you didn't buzz. No, well, I find you sort of mesmerising, Peter. <laughs> I cannot take my eyes off that belly. I mean, I think, try, trying to extract a positive here, I think that all I was thinking as you wobbled around the stage was, the sooner I get like back to the, the gym, the better. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I think you are going to inspire a lot of men to get into the gym tomorrow. And I think, I think that is a good thing. Okay, thanks, judges. Yeah, thank you. Mixed opinions there, I think it's fair to say. But if you want to see Peter back here for Saturday's big final, call 090 double one 32 22 05. And the line's open after we've seen the very last act. Ladies and gentlemen, Peter Cogler. That's it. <laughs> Now, our next act does his best work when his mouth is shut. A little bit like Ant here. <laughs> shut it. That's better. It's ventriloquist Gareth Oliver. What's your name? It's Gareth. Hello, Crouching Tiger. Hidden Dragon. Looking good. Gareth, it was very clever. It's three yeses. You're in the semi-final. Being in the semi-final, it means so much. I've done this for ten years now. If I didn't love it, I'd, I'd have stopped by now. He puts 100% into what he does, and I'm very proud. I was a red coat at 18, I'm 28 now. To think that I was once this little boy, sat on my granddad's lap, watching the Royal Variety, I would never have dreamt I could one day be on that TV. This came along. Feels like I've been thrown a lifeline. Tonight, I've got to do something different. He's very talented. But what do you do next? I'm taking another gamble. I've got a dollar specially made. It's a brand new character. If he blows it tonight, career over. It is a big risk. It's make or break for me. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Gareth Oliver! Good evening, everyone. Uh, this is my friend, Pava. Pava Potts. Pava, say good evening. Good evening. Lovely to be here. Ananda, you look fantastic. I would love to take you on a little date. Hang on. You don't even talk like that. Yes, I do, you idiotto. No, you don't. Tell them how you speak. Do I have to? <laughs> yes. No, don't laugh. No one takes me seriously when I talk like this. That is why I sing like this. Hello there. One north on northern descender. Hey, Gareth, a little joke. Go on, then. What is the difference between a coconut and Simon Cowell? I don't know what's the difference. One is thick and hairy. The other one is a coconut. <laughs>
Oh, oh, well, thank you, you're very kind. I've got something to you, Gareth, as thank well. Thank you. Hey, I love you all too. <laughs> Stand on the doors, eh? <laughs> thank you, Brad. Uh, Nearly. How, how, <laughs> how was that? Did you enjoy that? I loved it. Please I absolutely with your loved performance? it. Yeah, I, I thought you did very well tonight. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> Why? Because last time we saw your first audition, you were throwing yeah. your voice a lot and doing, doing the uh, martial arts kind of badly done movie thing. Why move on to the puppet today? Just because I didn't want people to think I was a one-trick pony. Uh -huh. I wanted them to know that I'm actually useless at lots of things, you know. <laughs> so, uh, I hope I entertain you tonight. Anyway, guys, and just to let you know that if I do make it through, there's something completely different in the final as well, and uh, it's going to be incredible, so please, Good. please vote for me. That's what we like to hear. Let's see, uh, let's see what the judges throw up. Simon, you buzzed, and you buzzed before the hairy coconut guard, which I was surprised at. <laughs> That's why you got it. Why, why did you buzz, Sam? Uh, well, I mean, if you said there was something incredible to go into the final, why didn't you do something incredible tonight? <gasps> oh, come on. You know, I've seen a lot it's of... It's over now between us. It's over. <laughs> Peter, look, you know, you're a nice guy, you know, blah, 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 but, you know, it, this to me was... Gareth. OK, Gareth. <laughs> Bottom of the bill at a very small nightclub. Um, this is not... <laughs> Opinion, what I would be looking for this year because I've seen thousands and thousands of people do this sort of act better. Pierce, is that a, really? I think that is the biggest load of rubbish I've yeah. ever heard. <laughs> you have now shown us two very good tricks. The first audition, you threw your voice, never seen that before, it was terrific. It is incredibly difficult to throw your voice and sing through a puppet. It's I not like that. normal ventriloquism. I know that. He doesn't like anything that isn't a stick insect singing Raise Me Up, age 19 <laughs> with long hair. Right? You are about a variety. This show is about a variety, and I thought that was a very, very good performance. Congratulations. Thank you, Chris. Amanda, very briefly, yeah. you were very animated during that. Did you like yeah. that act? I thought it was sensational. I think you were a real showman. You really sold yourself well. Fantastically inventive. And you've got a great singing voice. He's got a great singing voice. <laughs> <laughs> Well done. Uh, to see Gareth back here for the big final on Saturday, it's 090-1-32-22 or 6, but not yet. Not till we've seen all eight acts. One more time, ladies and gentlemen, Gareth Oliver! <laughs> It's not even that. Go. It's not even that hard. What, what do you mean? Go. I can't get up. It's too high. Go. Go. Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Hello, hello. I got the gear. I got the gear. <laughs> I'll split my shoulders. I didn't want to be in the final on Saturday anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Time for a quick break now, but we've still got two more acts determined to win your votes and the place in Saturday's big...